Hello folks, this video is going to be a short tip answering a question we sometimes see in support regarding sun and shadow position. So usually the question goes something like this. We'll get an email that says help. No matter what date and time settings I use, I can't get the sun to shine into my windows and my renders are turning out way too dark. Now, this of course has to do with the orientation of the windows in your SketchUp model. So we all know that the sun rises in the east and sets in the west, and it traces a predictable arc across the sky depending on the month and the location. So by default, I believe SketchUp models are geolocated in the northern hemisphere, actually in Boulder, Colorado. So it goes without saying that some windows are going to get more light than others. In the northern hemisphere, for example, windows facing south and southwest receive the most direct sunlight, and windows facing north may get very little. So if I move the shadow sliders around in this SketchUp model, for example, there's really nothing I can do to get a lot of direct sunlight in through this window. So if we move it over here into January, during the daylight hours, you can see the interior of this space is always in shadow. It's only if I go all the way to like four, no. Okay, so there's nothing I can do there to get that shadow into the room. If we go through the year, interior still in shadow, maybe we can get a little bit of light into that room in the early morning and late evening, but most of the time when we're rendering, we want to use the daylight hours closer to the center here. And that interior space is always going to be in shadow. So what are our options? Well, the brute force solution is to just select the entire model, come into the rotate tool, and just rotate the entire model around. So now we're getting some light coming into this room. But this is silly, and you really don't have to do this. Another option would be to go into SketchUp Model Info under Geolocation and set the location manually. So if we knew this model was in the Northern Hemisphere and it's not give, getting any light, I could set a Southern Hemisphere latitude and we might get some, some light into that space. But there's a better option than this. Um, setting the geolocation manually is kind of a hassle, and there's a much better way to do this. So I'm going to close that. All right, so the best solution to deal with sun direction is to use Trimble's Solar North plugin, which gives you an intuitive, easy to understand tool for setting the north angle in your model. And this lets you set the shadow direction with a lot more control. So if we come up to Window, Extension Warehouse. I'm just going to search for Solar North. Make sure you're logged in to your Trimble account. It's right here, published by the SketchUp team. I'm going to click Install. Now, one thing I want to note is that this Solar North extension does require a SketchUp Pro license. So this will work for anyone using SketchUp Pro. Unfortunately, it won't work if you're using SketchUp Make 2017. Uh, you'll have to do it one of the other ways that I discussed. But for those of you who are using SketchUp Pro, go ahead and install Solar North. Yes, to install. OK. And normally the toolbar will pop up, but I must have disabled it in the past. So. Go into my toolbars, and we have Solar North, and there it is. It's a three-button toolbar, but we're really only going to use one of the buttons. So to set the north angle, first I'm going to hide the roof here so we can see what's happening, and I'll just zoom overhead. We're going to click the center button, and this is the Set North tool, and this is going to give me a circular cursor. I just click once to start the tool, and now I can move my cursor around, and as you can see, this lets me set an arbitrary north angle and move the shadows into any position that I want. So now we can get light coming in through our window. Click one more time to finalize the north position. And there we go. That's all there is to it. So solar north is by far the best way to set the shadow position manually and get some light into your interiors. And if you've got a SketchUp Pro license, I recommend you install this as soon as possible. All right. Thanks, guys. I'll see you in the next one.